Welcome back Minecraft fans, this is PunkD76 and we're here in Tutorial Land. Today I'm going to bring you this, my charcoal burner, uh, my charcoal generator. Really, really simple little build. You come along, you throw a st your stack of logs up in here, it gets cooked through in a furnace and it ends up being turned into charcoal. In here, a little lamp to indicate that stuff is going through the system. It is a very, very simple build. And it is a renewable fuel source. Uh, grow yourself some trees, whack it in there. Really, really simple. This is the hole you're going to need. It is three blocks across by four blocks deep and goes down by two. So one, two, three, four this way, and two blocks in the ground. There you go. Over here, we need the materials. We need one furnace. We're going to need four hoppers, two comparators, uh, sorry, one comparator, two repeaters, one redstone, two picture frames, or item frames, one redstone lamp, some building blocks, some uh, trap doors of your choice, building blocks are of your choice. We're going to need two droppers as well. Right, let's get in there. So go into your, into your hole. We need to go down in this corner. And on the wall, place your furnace. So it's over in this corner here. Get your droppers. And you need to go up with the dropper, crouch in place, up with the hopper. So the two four hoppers are facing upwards. Hopper. You need to place a hopper going into the side of your dropper. So this will take items from the furnace down and into the dropper. You need to place one into the front of the furnace and you need to place one into the, the the top of the furnace so crouch and place put one in the top it's coming back down here in your hole place a block in the corner in the corner leave a gap of two and one there you need a repeater take a repeater going into this block so this repeater, when there's an item gets moved from this hopper into the dropper, the repeater will pick up a signal and fire it round into this block. The repeater will pick up that signal and boost the strength of the signal. Bit of redstone here to move the signal round, and a redstone there, a uh, repeater there. So basically, the, the once an item is in the dropper, the signal gets right the way round back into the dropper and that will fire it upwards and this system will fire off this dropper as well come up the top we need these chests oh we need chests where are my chests there there we go we need to place a chest one on top of there and one there so you know a double chest there and then place a single chest on top of the dropper uh, top of the hopper come around here get your redstone lamp and place it on top of this block like so and that is basically you done guys it is that easy so we cover this all up we don't need to see this we don't need to see that just fill in the holes oh uh, one more dropper forgot sorry hopper Above the dropper here, I wish they changed the names of these, it gets very confusing. Above this dropper, then we need to aim it into the back of this chest. So it goes there. So the items will come up, go into the hopper, and get fired into this chest or pass it into this chest. Place a block on top of the hopper. That just helps on lag and helps any items being falling in that we don't necessarily want in there. I like to come around the side, trap door trap door trap door just hide those hoppers um, on the front item frame item frame and then we go to here let's move these items out let's get our wood and get a bit of coal right let's place one piece I'm still crouched one piece in there one piece in there Right, what you need to do, 
the first time you use this, you will need to get uh, a few bits of coal. You don't need a lot. You, you can get away with one bit of coal in this. Um, but put some coal in here. This will feed it down into the furnace. And then when you can finish your, your um, building, or, or cutting down the trees, you come and throw your logs into here. They will start feeding down. The coal is already in here feeding it. And the light should flick on. So you know that the wood is being cooked and is moving around. What you need to do, this needs to cook for a little while. You need to get enough coal or charcoal into the uh, furnace and the hopper feeding into it. Both need to become full with charcoal before you'll start getting the excess being left in here. You'll see the, these, this one will drop in. There you go. So it takes a little bit to back up, but once it starts backing up, once you've got any charcoals in here, you can take this out absolutely no problem. And uh, you know you've got plenty of coal in underneath feeding your system. So that is you done, guys. Super easy. Super simple, nice little charcoal burner. Um, that's it. Well, I hope this is helpful. Hope you enjoyed it. Please hit the like button and subscribe, uh, subscribe. And hit the notification so you get my next tutorials when they come out. Please check out my channel. I do with, uh, my videos I do with Junior. It's a 20 minute Minecraft where myself and Junior, we just have, uh, we, we have a laugh in, um, in a survival world. And trying to survive, uh, which we don't tend to do all that well. But yeah, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it and uh, hope it's helpful. So take care and I'll see you in the next one. Cheers, guys. Goodbye.